Okay, let's try this again. Now that I... <clears throat> I actually... Spend around half an hour with this outside of video, and I... At some point I had this correct. I had to check it at the uh, walkthrough, because I just couldn't figure it out. This actually doesn't matter when it comes to the stones. Stones? Crystals. Uh, I actually need to have these only... Is it here? Yeah. So that these point to each other. This side doesn't matter what's on the back. Although this has the one-eyed pyramid and this will have the uh, water. But these are uh, the opposite. So this will have a uh, harpoon and this will have the fish. That I had correct at one point when I tried it. Uh, is this the one? I think so. Except no. This needs to be on the fish. Here. Like so. Now th the one I think is pointed at this. Or was this supposed to be the fish? I'm not quite sure anymore. Let's try this. This has fish and uh, one I think. So there will be harpoon on the other side. No, there will be water on the other side, I hope. Yeah. No, this can't be it. Oh god. Now this has what? It has water, okay, so that's fine. So this is correct, yeah. And now the last one goes here. I think so. At least I do think so. So this is harpoon and on the other side should be fish. Let's see. Yeah. Like so. Now these are correct. I think. But there's no way of confirming that. It doesn't tell me it's all right. And the next tip on the walkthrough was that the uh, center ones are opposites of these symbols. Which kind of has me wondering. Because I can figure out that the uh, fire is sort of op opposite to water. And uh, bird is opposite to fish out of these things. How the hell? And this we can't even move. It's stuck. I don't think it's supposed to move. Yeah. So pot ring is opposite to harpoon. Why? I don't understand. Where the hell did it go? Oh, I can roll it from here. So now we have fire and water. And bird and fish. Like so. I think they were supposed to be next to each other and not on the opposite side. Now the merim is opposite of one-eyed pyramid. But why? I don't know that happens. And beyond that I don't know what happens. So we might get stuck again. Oh, it's, uh, it looks like some kind of visual history of the Marum people. What? According to this first tablet, 
Oh my god. It turns out the Marum came to Earth inside a type of spaceship from another planet. They're aliens? Okay. Not that anything should surprise me at this point, but still. They look very different back then, though. It must have been a long time ago. The Most ship likely. looks to have been a living thing, according to these drawings. Wait a minute. Could this be their ancient god? One of the dragons? I think it has to be. After they arrived on Earth, their species divided in two. One crawled into the sea, the other onto land. What does that mean? Are we Marum? Good God. This must be a while later, because the Marum look like they do today. At least the ones who went into the sea do. The other ones? They have wings. Oh. I'm going to guess. I'd say that the ones who went to live on land became the Alation, which means the Marum and Alation are related. Okay. In this one, they're living close to each other and in peace. And it seems they share equally in the production of Tan Yen, which attracts fish for both peoples to eat. Then something happens. Or, it looks like, and the Marum and Alation move away from each other. Where did you get that? In this last one, Tan Yen is beginning to become scarce, and the Marum are losing many of their young ones to the Snapjaw. They fear the elation, and they forget their common heritage. At the very end, there's a prophecy, I think. The Marum and the elation joining hands once again. When they do, Tan Yen becomes plentiful and both people prosper. Huh, and I guess I'm the catalyst there. The crystals on the altar light up the entire cave. Oh, it was just for the light. Oh. Is it the same story if I look at it again? These tablets tell the story of how the Marum and Alation were once one people. They came to Earth inside an ancient dragon and lived in harmony, producing and sharing Tan Yen. Then war broke out, and the two peoples turned on each other, which caused a shortage of Tan Yen and the death of many Marum. There's a prophecy at the end. One day, it seems, the Alation and Marum will reconcile and prosper. Yeah. This is probably the same thing, because it says drawings. But I haven't looked at the symbol. It's a circular indentation framed with the image of two dragons biting each other's tails. Almost exactly like the markings on my talisman. My what now? My talisman? Uh, oh, the one that I... What the hell happened to it? Uh, let's go talk to the lady queen. Queen lady. I guess... I swim any faster? Yeah. Can't remember what happened to the thing. I took it off the compass. Huh. Anyway. Can we talk for a minute? Yes, Gatherer. We may. Abandoned? Was it abandoned? Why would I think it was abandoned? Why was the cave with the altar and the wall painting just outside the city abandoned? What? Show us this cave. Immediately. Wow. Wow. <laughs> so they haven't... <laughs> they don't go all out much, do they? I lit the cave by placing the crystal from your palace, together with three more crystals I found on the altar, and moving the stone rings into their correct positions. Can it be that you are... but you are a gatherer? You cannot be she. I am the catalyst to bring Ooh. the peace. Who can't I be? Or something. The water stiller. Water stiller, that's she it. She who, by prophecy, 
will deliver us from strife and unite us as one people. She who will uncover the ancient shrine. Yeah, that's me. Looks pretty ancient to me. This is the shrine, yes. And you have brought light to the darkness as well. But the other prophecies, you have not fulfilled them. You have not proven yourself to be the water stiller yet. How can I do that? Come back with us, and we will tell you. All right. So, am I to steal water? Who is... Um, well... Who is the water stiller? She is of the prophecies. She will bring an end to strife and unite our people. How can I prove that I'm the water stiller? You have uncovered the ancient shrine and brought light to the darkness. But this could be just chance. You must show us the witness you carry of your mission to the balance. The talisman! Damn, I lost it when the storm hit us. Okay. You must also kill a snapjaw with a spear. And then you will have proven yourself to us. Once you have done this, we will aid you in your quest to make us one people. Could you lend me a spear? Where do I begin? Take this spear and slaughter a snapjaw. Thank you. This must be done to prove your strength and to prove you are of the Miram. Where do I find the snapjaw? You have found it. If you are the water stiller, you will find a way. It's in the ship. Uh, what remains of the ship? I made a note. Cap. Oh, no, not this one. Thursday afternoon. The Merum Queen believes I may be what they call the water stealer. Why not? After all, I am April Banda Mbata. And I'm probably what the Vena call the Kan Angla. Where did that come from? So, why not the water stealer? Vena? Kan Angla? Is that something I just don't understand? Thing is, this time I have to prove it. The water stiller is supposed to uncover an Asian shrine and bring light to the darkness, which I've already done. Then I have to show some proof of my mission. The talisman which the captain locked away in the chest. Oh, right. And kill a snapjaw. Kill a snapjaw? What am I? An Amazon hunting woman person? Amazon hunting woman person? Think not. I have a hard time snacking a fly. Smacking a fly. <laughs> snacking. <laughs> but if I want to get out of here, the talisman probably went down with the ship. I wonder how difficult it would be to get a hold of it. Not that hard, because now I have the uh, spear to fend off the snap jaw. I don't. Where the hell did it go? Is it this one? It's a spear. <laughs> okay. A harpoon, I guess it's called in maritime terminology. Shouldn't harpoon have something you launch with, out of, from? Yay. It's a Marion spear. Or harpoon. Whatever. Whatever. That's, uh, that's what I'd say. Green stuff. Um, do I need to exhaust her? Can we talk for a minute? Yes, gatherer. We may. Goody. Oh. Well, I think it's in the uh, thing. Did you say I could find the shipwreck? Oh, shipwreck. <laughs> past and beyond the Landwalker's bubble. Yeah. Thanks for your time. My time is yours, gatherer. Thank you. I thought it said uh, uh, Snapjaw, but it said actually uh, Shipwreck. Is there anything? No, just the algae. Seaweed, actually. To the Shipwreck. How the hell am I gonna... Market. Oh, I did. That was easy. 
It's dead. I killed it. I'm surprised. Can I take it? Loot the snapjaw. I'll need something to bring back to prove that I killed the snapjaw. Ah, take the fin or something. Teeth, tooth. This tooth will do just fine. Tooth, yeah. Oh man, that's sharp. I had no idea Snapjaw had razor teeth. If I did, better not think about that now. Yeah, enter the shipwreck, I would say. Into the wreck. Ah, there's my talisman. I don't think there will be much it's else. It's my talisman! What incredible luck! That must be it. Luck. Or it might be fate. Yay. Now I have all sorts of things. Guess I can just... Yeah, because I can't go anywhere here. Well, let's just leave. That was easy. So now it's an adventure, not so much a puzzle. I'm a better adventurer than I'm a puzzle solver. I don't have the brain for puzzles. Creepy sounds. Oh, I didn't take a look at the tooth. Let's do that now. It's the sharp fang from a snap jaws... Uh... Jaw. Snap just jaw. And this is fine. It's the talisman of the balance. Yay. Uh, do we have anything to discuss or do I have to just show the things I got? Can we talk for a minute? Yes, Gatherer. We may. Thanks for your time. <laughs> well, My let's... Time is yours, Gatherer. Uh, present the evidence. I have a tooth. Here's a tooth from the dreaded Snapjaw that guarded the shipwreck. Proof of my strength and courage. You have fulfilled that part of the prophecy. If you fulfill the rest, we will acknowledge you as the water stiller. Alright. Um, look at this. Here's proof of my mission. A magical talisman with the sign of the balance. It means that I'm the 13th guardian of the balance. You have fulfilled that part of the prophecy. If you fulfill the rest, we will acknowledge you as the water stiller. What? The rest? Wait, what? What? Wasn't that it? What the hell was the third? I did that. Talisman? Um... Talk for a minute. Yes, gatherer. We may. Didn't I just prove Thanks myself? Time. My time is yours, gatherer. Uh, uh, what am I missing? Wait. It's the talisman of the balance. Yeah. The yeah, she must be. Um, Queen of the Beneath. Cover the edge and shrine in broad light. 
This could be by chance. You must show us witness you carry of your mission to the balance. The talisman dam. Kill a snap jaw, then you will have proven yourself to us. Once you have done this, we will aid you in your quest to make us one people. Yes, why do I find it? If you are water still, you will find a way. Can we talk for a minute? Thanks for your time. Can we talk for a minute? Thanks for your time. E what? I have done the three things. Have not your, you have not proven yourself to be water still yet. Uh, I have to do something in the cave still. Ah, uh, does this go with the uh, God damn it. With this thing? Yeah. Now there's light in the dark. And it wasn't by chance. What's in the... Niche? It's a small niche containing what appears to be a shard of a stone. It's a piece of the stone disc. Oh. No, wait. It's only one half of a piece. Oh. It looks like it's been divided in two. Strange. Well, the other half is with the uh, wing people. It's a small niche. It's a small niche. And I can't do anything more with it. Uh, well. Merim stone. It's one half of one of the four pieces of the stone disc. I got this from the Temple Cave of the Merum. Nice. Well, maybe we can talk to the Queen again. Maybe? Well, we can, but she may just show us off to the uh, shipwreck. I'm not even gonna talk to her. I'll show her this. I've taken from you the object you've kept hidden for generations. It's part of the disc that will restore the balance and save the twin worlds from chaos. Are you like that? You have indeed fulfilled all but one of the prophecies. What? You might yet be the water stiller. We would not have thought she would come in our lifetime. All but one? Good. Then you'll take me to your sleeping god. There is but one more prophecy you must fulfill. What is it? There's more? Sure, there's always more. That's the fun part about prophecies. Yeah, there was supposed you to be must three. unite our people once again. Oh, little but things. But you said you were united, that there's no strife between Miram. The water stiller will come to bring our people together again, to unite us and save us. This has still not come to pass. Until you do so, the prophecies of the water stiller have not fully come to pass. So where's the opposition then? Would you mind telling me that? I think I know now what the prophecies mean when they say your people will be reunited. The Miro are at peace with each other, yes? But you're not at peace with the elation. The wind demons. Oh, whoop de do! How'd you come up with that? Enemies. Right now they might be, but it wasn't always like that. Not according to the carvings in the temple cave. What do you mean? You're the same. Once upon a time, long ago, the Miram and the Elation were one people. What? This is heresy. No, go see the walls. I'm just telling you what I saw in your temple. This was a very long time ago, and the one species soon divided in two. One sought refuge in the sea, the other on the winds. 
mind? But both the Miram and the Elation were dependent on the other for various reasons. Amongst them, Ten Yen, which was abundant where the two people lived in close proximity to each other. Apparently, there was peace between your two people for a very long time. But then something happened. Something that caused a war to break out. Yeah. Both the Elation and the Miram moved far away from each other. And ever since then, your people have had a tough time finding Ten Yen. I think the only way to save the Miram from a slow death, and the Elation as well probably, is to reconcile you with your, uh, common ancestry. How can we believe you, Water Stiller? Your words are too outrageous, <gasps> and the consequences were you to be speaking the truth are grave. Go see the paintings in if the game. If you don't believe me, check out the temple walls. The whole story has been recorded there, probably when you first came to this place. Yeah. But what will our people say? I don't know. What will they think when we tell them they are brothers and sisters to the winged demons? Bloop, 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 bloop. You're their queen. And so you'll have to make them understand and accept their heritage. As must the elation, I expect. And I don't think it will be any easier for them to come to terms with their history. Mm -hmm. You must go to them, then, to find if our temple speaks the truth. Where are they? And if they are willing to speak with us like civilized people. They won't. I guess I must. Water stiller or not. If you don't reunite with them, you will die. Eventually. We will bring you to the shores of their closest island. Ah, thank you. And we will await word from you on their answer. Goody. Does this mean you believe me? No. You are the water stiller. You are prophecy. So now I am that again. We will follow your directions and fulfill our destiny. One of our people will bring you to Aleus, a night's journey from here. Once there, you will find the Elation and speak with their leaders. If they agree to meet, then we will do so in a place of your choosing. I promise I'll do my best. Goodbye. Goodbye. Safe journey, Water Stellar. We will hold on to the piece of the disc you found in the temple. What? If the Winged Demons, the Elation, agree to meet us, we will bring the stone. I think... I think I made a note. Um, I think I made two notes, actually. Yeah. Ooh, I'm out of breath. I just had to take care of a cat. Started shouting downstairs. I am the water stealer. How strange it is... What? How strange it is to be so insignificant, yet so important. There are so many who have been waiting for me or somebody like me to come and bring hope into their lives. It's truly amazing. And even more amazing, I'm able to cope with it. I'm still in denial, no question about that. But I'm warming up to the idea that I'm actually not just some tiny speck of dust in the cosmic infinity, but a person with a mission, with a place, with a purpose. Right now my purpose is to find the LS... Uh, how did she say that? Elation and reunite them with the Merum so that both species can thrive once more and another pause, it seems. Alright, where was I? Uh, can thrive once more. That done, I can find out what the Elation know. And then pay a visit to the sleeping god of the Merum, almost sleeping dog. I'm counting on this guy being one of the kin. If not, I have no idea what to do next. Guy. Guy? Okay, so... 
let's expect him to be a guy. Early Saturday morning, back home at this... What? Back... Ah, back home at this time I'd be safely snugged up in bed. Safe with the knowledge that it's Saturday. I've got nowhere I have to be. I can just relax all day long. Maybe go to the cafe, hang out for a while. Maybe go to the park, whatever. This all started a week ago yesterday. One week of mysteries and danger and strange revelations about the very nature of the cosmos. And I'm still reasonably sane. At least that accounts for something. Now I know there is an uh, Alasian village somewhere on Alase. The question is where? And how do I get there? If the Merim and uh, Alasian used to live close to each other, the village should be somewhere down by the sea. Maybe right around the corner. Yeah, I don't think so. I think it's further up. Who knows where? What is this? Why can't I do anything with it? I can only look at April. So, is this Monkey Island now? I could get lost if I just wander off into the jungle with no idea of what the island looks like or where I'm heading. Yeah, maybe tie the rope around your something and something. There's a coil of rope among the debris. Takes it. And debris from another capsized ship. These must be dangerous waters. Is this something? Up the path. It must be like an anthill or something. <laughs> I could go up the anthill path. Through arc. Arch. Up the path. Up the path. Um. Let's see the arch first. Let's see it faster. Oh. Big grab, I thought that was one of the elation. Don't have to be so close to look at it. Some kind of giant crab. Do we still have our spear? It sounds like the poor thing's in a lot of pain. Oh. Yeah, the shell does look way too tight. Maybe he's outgrown it but can't shed it. Or whatever it's called. Yeah. And I made a note. Wait, uh... Yeah, I have gone over... Gone over all of this. I found this crab-like creature on the beach and it looked like it was in pain, like it was getting slowly strangled or something. It was really sad, but I couldn't do anything. The thing is just too big and solid for me. I need somebody to help me. Somebody began strong. Where do I find a person like that on an island like this? Ugh. Yeah, it's a good question. Can we talk? I'll just take a shot here and ask you. Is there any chance you speak like a real language? Like, um, Arcadian or English? You're speaking all tongue. Okay. Now, is there some kind of magic I have to learn, or potion I have to drink, or eat, or ingest in some way to learn your language? Because that's usually how it goes. Hey! No? Too bad, although I'm glad I don't have to draw blood or swallow a stone or something. Can't help but feel that you're asking me for help, though. It's the strangest thing. After all, you're just clicking your claws, aren't you? It's not as if you're really talking, is it? Why did why why don't the Merim speak all tongue? I get the strangest feeling that it's it's asking me for help, but I don't know what to do. Uh, she was talking about potions. Does um, any of my wind bind? Light a sleeve. Oh, but they are for me. How does this work again? If I drink it, it starts to... Wind? 
Maybe he's overweight. No, not that. There's a village. What the hell? How's that a village? It's the village of the giant crabs. Hey, that sounds like a great name for a B-movie. Village of the giant crabs. And there's another path up to it's the statue. statue. Clear, unpolluted waters, overflowing with life. Just one more reason why Arcadia is both the vacationers and environmental activists' wet dream. Literally. <laughs> Might be. Maybe I'll check out the uh, other side. That was way up. Oh. Ruins. And a statue. The top half of the statue depicts a big mouthed creature calling out. Uh oh. The bottom half of the statue depicts a large eared creature listening intently. I smell puzzle. And there's a thing I can do something with, I suppose. Oh crap. It's a creature with a big mouth. It's a creature with big ears. It's a creature with large ears. Ooh, large ears. And it's a symbol of... It's a triangular hole, oh. like a keyhole. I don't think I have anything triangular on me. Unless... The flute... Is triangular enough? It's not. <laughs> Hey, actually, flute. Let's play the flute now that I remembered it. <clears throat> I guess he's not around. I should try again later. Oh, okay. It's Roots. the ruins of an old city. It's a huge volcanic mountain. How do you know it's volcanic? Sapling? It's a tiny tree. There's a hole. It's a whole hole. Complete it's hole. It's a deep hole. More like a crevice, actually. Caused by some kind of seismic activity. God, it must be at least 50 meters down. The crevice widens out into a huge cave just below. And there's water at the bottom. Can I jump in? Uh, I suppose not. Is there any way going any further? Nope. So, I guess pieces to the puzzle are at the uh, other statue. There's a lot of supposing going on. Well... This isn't the sea. Was there a way to go this way? No, let's head up then. Worry about this guy later. Maybe I could have gone this way. No, I don't think so. Well, maybe. Fire? It's an old fireplace. Alright. Statue top. The top half of the statue depicts a creature with a big mouth calling out. Oh, it's the same piece all the way. The bottom part of the statue depicts a creature with large ears listening to something. And? It's a creature with large ears. It's a creature with a big mouth. It's a triangular hole, like a keyhole. Huh. Intriguing. 
not very helpful. Not helpful at all. I go this way? No, she's just running this way. Okay. What the hell? Maybe I can rougher him? A hope? Or <laughs> offer him a rope? Uh, can I? I can't break the shell. It's too thick and solid. Thick and solid. Thick and solid. Out of sleeve. Invisibility. Can I bind magic to it somehow? I'll save it for when I really oh. need it. Yeah. Uh. Crow, help. Um, is he around now? I guess he's not around. I should try again later. No, let's offer him a rope then. To what end? He doesn't want. Medallion? Talisman of the balance? Look at this. No. I don't know how anything would help at this point. Monkey, of course, is always helpful. Maybe it has something to do with the hole. If I take light asleep and jump down the hole. Clackety clack. I get the strangest feeling that it's asking me for help. Clackety clackety clack, clackety clack, clackety click. Oh, I have the rope. I can descend with the rope. Maybe. Oh. Use the rope on the sapling. Sapling is strong enough to hold. Well, if I take the lighter sleeve potion, I can take the lighter sleeve potion when I'm at the bottom. The rope should be able to hold my body weight. What about the sapling, though? It's a tiny tree. Yeah, that's the problem. I thought it's a video. Bunch of nests. It's something that looks like a hole, but it's just a nest. Big nests, once housing the elation, but now empty and in disrepair. Ah. Where are you going? Oh. Rubble, rubble, rubble. Where'd you go? Oh. That's a Marum City. Oh yeah. What about the rubble? It's the remains of a stone structure that probably fell down here through the crevice. Uh, There's be. a piece amongst the rubble that looks like a bolt or a key. Ah, it's intact. Is it triangular? Can we take it? Yes, we can. It must be triangular. Yeah. Oops. 
It's a kind of stone key carved into the uncanny likeness of a key with the head on the end. Oh, I probably need another one. This has ears, the other one probably has the mouth. Can I go down? Climb down? Well, I can. Let's climb down. Um... Okay. How do I climb up? Is my next question. Oh, climb up. <laughs> That's strange. Oh, I guess we're done here. Uh, were they the other way around? I don't know. Let's look at the base. Let's stick the thing in it. Huh. What to do with it? Ah. Oh. What did it do? This is looking that way now, and this has <laughs> gone away. Hmm. How would I know which way I... Have I seen these symbols before? It's the talisman of the balance. I can't inspect it any further. Well, closer. Do they have the same... Same place has been cracked. Would it be on the side of the mountain if something flew out of there? I don't know. That's just one. Ah. Maybe they did both, both. Say one on this. Oh, that's broken too. I don't know. I don't know. Now they're looking that way. Maybe they should be looking up the mountain. Wait. If this guy was listening to the mountain and this guy was screaming for help or something. I have no fucking clue. Is there anything obvious about the other? Uh, you're not willing to... These are looking that way. I kind of feel like they should be looking at this thing. Whatever that is. Would you want to talk? Click, click, the click, 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 click. Asking me for help, but I don't know what to do. Maybe that's the solution. I get the strangest feeling that it's asking me for help, but I don't know what to do. Click, clack, 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 click. feeling that it's asking me for help, 
but I don't know what to do. Oh god. Click, clack, 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 click. Doesn't ring any bells. Now they're looking completely different way. Uh Click, clack, 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 click. Click, clack. Click, clack, clack, click. There's only three. There's four rings. Unless it's like one is click and clack. Click, clack. Click, 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 click. One, two, three. F click, clack, 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 click. So this looks like five. This could be something like four and upside down. One, something. I have no fucking clue. <laughs> it's a triangular hole, like a keyhole. Yeah. And this doesn't make any distinct noises, does it? Nope. It's a triangular hole, like a oh, keyhole. No, no, no. Mm, I'm clueless. Uh, how, how, how? The top half of the statue depicts a creature with a big mouth calling out. Calling out probably at the sea, I would think. It's looking that way. Now if I turn the thing... Oh, wrong thing. It's looking the same way. What if I... I'm still looking that way. So it doesn't turn them. But it turned around the other one. What the hell is the point of this? It's a triangular hole. Yes it is, like I know, I know, I know. Oh. Click, clack, 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 click. Maybe I would have needed to turn each one of these six times. Doesn't make any distinct sound, does it? At any point? Same sounds all the way over. It's a triangular hole. Yes, it is. Like I know, I know, I know. No. All the sounds were the same. Which one was I turning? I'm oh, right. right. It's a creature with large ears. Yeah. It's a creature with a big mouth. It is. What are these symbols? Let's take this thing with us. Oh, now it's turned. Maybe they need to face each other. If this guy shouts at the air guy on the other side, and vice versa. 
How the fuck am I gonna stop it on the right spot? Because I don't even know in which way the other one is. This could be a thing. Maybe if I aimed it at that. Let's say three turns and check what's going on. Uh, mouth. Mouth guy, yeah. Um. Which one? This. Yeah, one. Two. Three. That's back in the original position. Uh, so I think six or five. Let's turn four and see what's going on. And four. Yeah, now it's that way. Uh, yeah, let's try the other one the same. the mark? I don't know. No, that's offline. Take this guy with us. What the hell? Why the hell is it facing this way? The bottom part of the statue depicts a creature with large ears listening to something. Is there some marking on his hand? Looks like almost like an N and Z. Is there such marking on this foot? And then there's these parts. But it's pointing completely the different way that I want it to. Want it to. It's still here. What the hell? Now it's gone. Still gone. It's that way. Should turn on the other side, please. So it doesn't turn by... I mean, every turn. It doesn't move. No, because it's still there. Now it's close, but is it? If I turn it one, it turns back here. Wait a minute. So they have actually one, two, three, four positions. And there's four of these. Oh, fucking. I'm not gonna try them all. No, I'm not. And they were looking at this way, but now they're looking at that way. Which makes all sorts of senses. Oh, is he still saying the same thing? Yeah. I get the strangest feeling that it's asking me for help. But I don't know what to do. Yeah, me neither. These are looking left. Maybe I'll just turn them around. See what happens. 
Uh, let's go with the lower first. Where is it now? Still the same. Let's look in this way. I think it should look to the right. I don't know why. Like that. Now the top one. Nothing. Uh, missed. Nothing. There we go. I think it's the wrong way because nothing's happening. <laughs> I don't know. And if it was the right way, what... what, what what the hell would happen? Maybe the crab will thank me. Hey, you turned our statues. Thank you. There's nothing more for you to do. You may save the world now. I get the strangest feeling that it's asking me for help. But I don't know what to do. Yeah. I know that feeling. Yeah. What sort of markings do we have now? Sort of an arrow and one. I have no clue. I could just brute force it and see if anything happens, but I believe... Instead, I'm going to end it here and take a look at the uh, trusty old walkthrough. <laughs>